Hey students, in this video I'm going to show you how to add narration and music to assignment 4. In assignment 4 you have to write an essay and then you have to create an animated video based on that essay. So you're going to use your essay as the foundation for your animated video. To create your animated video we're going to use a program called Powtoon. Powtoon is an excellent application for creating animated videos, but unfortunately, one of the weaknesses of the program is that the audio features are not very good. It's very difficult to edit audio using Powtoon. Camtasia, on the other hand, has a lot more features. It's much more flexible. You can import many different files. You can remove any mistakes that you make in your audio files. You can move your audio files around. You can increase the volume of your narration. It's very, very flexible, very, very powerful. This is much more difficult to do using Powtoon. So to overcome this limitation, we're going to use another program called Audacity. Audacity is a free program which you can use for recording and editing audio. So the first thing you should do is go to Google. So you go to Google, type in Audacity, follow the download link, click here Audacity for Windows, and click on the Audacity installer. This will download the program to your computer, and once you finish downloading, you can then install Audacity on your computer. You will also need to install a plugin. You will need to install the Lame MP3 encoder. This basically allows Audacity to export MP3 files. It allows you to create MP3 files using Audacity. So you have to also download this. Click on the Lame download page. Click on the link here. And go down to the lame Windows EXE. This is the program. And again, it downloads to your computer. And then you, afterwards, you can install the lame plugin on your computer. There are three steps to complete your assignment. Step number one is writing your essay. Step number two is adding your narration and your music. And step number three is to create your animated video. So in this video, we're just going to look at step number two adding narration and music. So let's start with music, the background music. The best place to find free background music is YouTube. So you click on YouTube and click here on creation tools and you'll be taken to a library of free music that you can use as background music in your videos. You can search here by genre, the type of music, cinematic, classical, you can search by mood, calm, bright, happy. You can even search by instrument, drums, strings, piano. Let's try inspiration. And here's a list of free music. You should just listen to the different tracks and find one that you like. I found this one earlier, which I like. Click on play. So keep listening till you find something that you like. Once you do find something that you like, you can click here on download track and you can use this track in your movie. The next thing we are going to do is to open Audacity and record our narration. You can also import your narration from your smartphone. You can use your smartphone to record your narration and then bring this into Audacity, but it's actually quite easy to record your narration using Audacity. The advantage of using Audacity is that you can fix any mistakes that you make in your narration and you can increase the volume of your narration and you can do lots of editing to improve the quality. So to record your narration you just click here on the record button and Audacity will start recording. So now Audacity is recording everything that I'm saying. You can see here this is my narration. Open your essay, 
and you should start narrating your essay. Now, again, you don't have to worry about making a mistake because you can go back later using Audacity and fix the mistake. TPAC is a framework which stands for Technological, Pedagogical, and Content Knowledge. <clears throat> technological knowledge is knowing how to use technology for teaching. Technological knowledge is knowing how to use technology for teaching and learning. Pedagogical knowledge is knowing how to design effective learning environments based on teaching and learning principles. Mm. And content knowledge is the teacher's specialized area of subject knowledge, such as geography, physics, or English. So you can do that. You can record all of the narration for your essay. When you're finished, click stop, and then you can go back and edit your narration. So let's find out where we started. The start of our narration may be here. TPAC is a Yes, so using the select tool, which is this one, we can select all of this, which we don't need, and remove it. Now, here I'm clicking delete and nothing is happening. Don't forget, you have to first stop the track before Audacity will allow you to do any editing. It's kind of annoying and frustrating, but it's something you have to do. So stop the track, click delete, that's gone. So now we're going to go through very quickly and fix any mistakes and content knowledge. <clears throat> so there's a mistake. I coughed. So you can just select that and click delete. Again, you have to stop first. Gone. Technological. There's my breath. So you can actually remove that too. Have a listen. Technological. Get rid of that. Again, click stop. Technological knowledge is knowing how to use technology for teaching. Technological knowledge. So again, I made a mistake. It's easy to make mistakes when you're recording audio. So we want to remove all of this. Select it with the select tool. Press stop. Delete. Technological knowledge is knowing how to use technology for teaching and learning. Now here, you notice there's a big space. I paused for quite a long time. So we're going to remove some of that space. Select that. Maybe a little more. Pedagogical knowledge is knowing how to design effective learning environments based on teaching and learning principles. Mm. There is another mistake. Remove that. You should go through all of your narration and just remove any mistakes that you don't want. I think there is another one. Physics. Yes. Remove that. And once you've finished editing all of the mistakes, you will have a rated track of very high quality. You will also want to increase the volume of your narration. To do that, you should select all of your narration. And then you click here on Effect and you click on Amplify. This will increase the volume of your narration. You want your audience to hear your narration. So we're going to try increasing it by 6. 0, zero means no change. So we're going to, inc we're going to increase it by we'll try 6. Allow clipping. It's important to click that. OK. We can actually bring it up a little more. Try that. Allow clipping. Okay. There we go. Now, when we listen, it will be much louder. TPAC is a framework which stands for. The next thing we need to do is add our music to our narration. To do that, we just click on File. You have to press stop first, file, import, audio, and go to your music track, which you downloaded from YouTube. Mine is here. Here we go.
we also have to decide where we want our narration to start. So the beginning of your animated video, you will have your title slide. You might have a slide introducing your name and your partner's name. So you're going to need about 12 or 15 seconds at the beginning to introduce your video and tell your audience what your video is about. Therefore, you should move, use again, use the time shift tool and move your narration. Here are the number of seconds. We want our narration to start uh, at 11 seconds. I think that's a good idea. Here's the start of our narration. So it's just here at 11. So this space here will be used in your animated video to write the title of your video and maybe your name and your partner's name. Now you'll notice if we listen, TPAC is a framework which stands for it, but the music is much too loud. We can't hear our narration. So we have to reduce the volume of our background music when our narration starts. To do that, we're going to use a tool here called the Envelope tool. This is similar to Camtasia, but it's a little more difficult to use. So you go down to your music track, which is here, and you, you're going to add some audio points. I'm going to add one here, 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 and here. So this should be full. And then you just bring down the audio points. Let's say here and actually we want it down before the narration we're going to have to add another point so you fade down the music as your narration starts. Let's see if it worked. TPAC is a framework which stands for Technological, Pedagogical and Content Knowledge. Technological Knowledge, that sounds fine to me. We do the same thing at the end of our narration. We want to increase the volume of our background music so after your narration, once your narration is finished, you get, again, you click on the envelope tool and you can select, here's the end. So put one point there, another one there, another here and here. Let's go a bit closer. And now we can start to increase the volume of our music. Let's see how that worked. Such as geography, physics, or English. So once you're happy with your narration and you're happy with your background music and where it decreases and increases, you can then export as one file. Again, don't forget to click stop. Click on File, Export. I'm going to export the file as an MP3. So here, MP3. You're going to give it a name. I'm going to call this Completed Narration and Music. And you click on Save, and Audacity will export the file to your folder. To import your narration and music, to PowTunes, you just click here on Sound. You can choose here, Music Track. It doesn't matter because you're only importing one file. The narration and the music are together. Go to the file where you have your narration saved. Here is ours, Complete Narration and Music, together. Open that up. You can check here by pressing play. 
you also want to increase the volume. TPAC is a framework which stands for. That's fine. Click on. We know the narration starts at second 11, so it actually starts here at this point. So on our first slide, you can create your title and your names, etc., etc., and then you will start animating your video using your narration. TPAC is a framework which stands for. So you listen to your narration and add your animation here to show or illustrate the ideas in your narration. We're going to look at how to do that in another video.